Here's how to make homemade rice cakes. Wash and drain the rice about four to five times until the water runs clear. Cover with water, soak overnight, and dry. Don't use any of the various rice flour sold in stores as they result in different textures. Working in batches, grind the flour in a food processor until it results into a fine powder. Scrape the sides a few times. Or use a high power blender stopping and scraping often to prevent overheating. Now sift the flour three to four times, set aside any large clumps, and then grind again. I make the dough in two batches. In a microwave safe bowl, combine the flour and salt and gradually add in boiling water. Mix together and form into a dough. It should be sticky. Cover with plastic wrap, leaving a gap for the steam to release. Microwave for one minute, add about a tablespoon or two of water, and microwave again for another minute. Now spread some sesame oil on your work surface. You'll also need something to pound the dough with. Now pound and fold over the dough for about five minutes until the dough is smooth and elastic. Knead for about a minute, roll out and cut into four pieces. Shape into a cylinder and working from the center, roll out each piece. Cut into three to four pieces to make tteokbokki or cut into bite-sized pieces depending on size desired. Rub some sesame oil to prevent sticking. Now repeat the process with the remaining flour. If you're not using them right away, you can store in the fridge or the freezer. Enjoy!